M0FXB, welcome back to the Mazzy Dog Walks. Let's talk Kenwood TM Tango Mike 750. Just been having a really close look at the new photograph on on the Facebook page by Don Arnold, who, as we know, is closely involved with the Kenwood product, quite famous for the Kenwood D75. What a great guy. Anyway, if you look at the top, we can see Bluetooth. We were expecting that. GPS, APRS, all that kind of stuff. Um, one thing we definitely don't see is HF mode, okay? HF receive, which you do get on the Kenwood D75. You can actually int you can actually connect that wirelessly to your computer and have full screen receive on all the bands, including HF, which is a very cool free program that Kenwood do. All of their software is free, so remember you get that included. So what we're seeing is Wi-Fi and we're seeing two SD cards. These are the things that are standing out to me that I think, oh, they're gonna, there's gonna be a first here. There's gonna be something within this box that other radios don't do. Now we already know that the Kenwood D75 can use Blue DV by PA7 LIM to connect to reflectors, you know, um, reflector one Charlie, all that kind of stuff via Bluetooth, but you need the app. But I've got a feeling that this is going to be a standalone way of connecting using Wi-Fi to reflectors, no hotspot needed. Now, not confirmed, um, but you know, watch this space. They've got two SD cards, Y. Um, Wi-Fi, adding that, as you know, 7 Icom added that, didn't they? Icom have added Wi-Fi and we can use terminal mode, pretty sure via via Wi-Fi. Not sure though, because I've done it via Bluetooth. Um, so yeah, need to double check on my 705. There's no Wi-Fi in the in the Icon 52, by the way. So anyway, back to the, the TM750. Now remember, you're buying like a very, a very premium product when you buy Kenwood. I mean, I've still got my, my Kenwood TS2000. Absolutely love it. Never sell it and uh, I use it every day. So in their, in their leaflet, you'll see that they've actually used the words MMDVM, they actually do, and terminal and reflectors. So I think we've got a built-in hotspot here. Of course, it's a VHF, UHF, but it's a tri-band radio. Now, the latest product from Yesu uh, does not have Wi-Fi, yeah? Um, does it have 220 megahertz? Because the, the USA version of the TM750 is tri-brand is 220 megs confirmed gps um the new yesu ftx one i mean i got a feeling this dual band is going to be quite pricey though it's going to be 1200 pound i reckon quite a pricey you know quite pricey because it's premium and you know this isn't 2020 anymore times have changed in 2025 things cost more eggs cost more <laughs> rent has definitely cost more um and, and i feel for for families that are struggling but anyway so you've got these brand new premium products coming out you've got date is it dayton they call it the new the hamvention in uh in about a week's time i think so all these products are going to be on display for definite and uh, so the question i've got to the kenwood people is uh just why didn't you include the hf receive it seems like it was already on the board with the it was already on the board the hardware with the d75 not sure why that might not be included and to the yesu people we i understand you've decided to do a a plug-in module for the gps and bluetooth but why not a plug-in module for wi-fi you know it would have been nice to have that but i mean these these radios have already been shipped Thanks for watching my YouTube channel. Let me know what you think. 73.